Hey guys, welcome back to Vendertron's Fallout New Vegas walkthrough. Uh, in the last episode, we took the tour of the Repcon headquarters and we gained security access to the first floor. And we also obtained the first security key that we have to obtain. Uh, so now what we can do is we can actually use the security key um, that uh, in the wall in the terminal in the foyer. So that is for this one that we've already lockpicked this terminal here. So uh, uh, Jeannie May, is that her name? Jenny Millet, sorry. Jeannie May is in Novak. Novak. Uh, you can use the security pass here to hack that terminal. Um, so, but uh, we've kind of already cut that corner, but we still need the security key in order to um, do the free, ac the free quest access power. So, So let's just. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm okay. You don't have to do anything. Let's just open these. Make sure that there is no first aid kits in here. I'm gonna lock him in this room. Come on, Boone. Come out. Boone, come out. There you go. No, no, no. Shut the door. You need to go back. Ah, fine. Okay. So then, what we need to do is. Um, We've, we've also got the security pass and we've got the skill book. So now we need to uh, uh, head up to the second floor. And um, between moving from the first floor to the second floor, we actually bump into a, f a facial recognition scanner who asks for our identification. And what we need to do here is um, we need to either confuse the robot, ro robot and double talk him to let him to let us pass or if we have submitted our facial recognition data in this terminal here uh, that will help us and also if we picked up the security key card from uh, Janet Miller's um, badge so if this what happens is if you actually trip the security system um, you may have to fight uh, so we're trying to do that without setting off any security systems and um, yeah so we've accessed the first hidden wall location the second one is right here or sorry the first one is here the second one is on the tour and then th there's other ones on the second floor um, but we may be able to bypass the system without having to to worry about that so um, so the first thing we need to do when we get upstairs is gain access to uh, the security office to our left, I believe. So let's head off to the second floor. Okay, so we are on the second floor and there is where are we yes so if we actually go across uh, see there's a robot there we want to make sure that we can get to him without setting off any alarms and there's like a million of them so and they're coming this way okay do 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 is he going to turn around and go back? No, he's coming this way. <laughs> go away! Go away! Go away, robot! <laughs> Dang it! He wants to talk to me and tell me Hello, that I'm... Mrs. I hope you have an excellent day Oh, work right, because we have the security pass. Okay, so apparently I am Mrs. Millet. So because I have the security pass, we have access to the second floor as well. It's the third floor that you have trouble getting into because there's security access. But if you go into this room here, you can actually access this terminal. And if you hack into it... Okay, so then you hack into this terminal if you don't have the security pass, and you can add the facial data to this as well. Uh, so you can pause... And, uh, oh, sorry, you can pause and read these if you, if you want. Um,
Yeah, so, okay, so, and on this desk there is the second skill book, uh, which is one of three in uh, this book. So we have the Nikola Tesla, which is the energy weapons is increased, and then the science. And then I believe there's also a second uh, Nikola Tesla and you. So let's read that, and our energy weapons are increased by four. Okay, so let's uh, let's just start looting. Wrench. Uh, what else is in here? Yeah. So we're gonna head back, just back here to. This is the main door, right? So, okay. Just wanted to get my bearings. Uh, is there a first aid kit in here? Always look in the toilets. Weird. Somebody died having a shit. <laughs> nice. Um, no first aid kits? Okay. Uh, okay, and then what we can do is you can either access this, the room through this door, or you can go around the other way. And that's what we're going to do is go around the other way. So these robots, they know me as Mrs. Millet. Um, and it doesn't matter anyways because we've added our mobile uh, facial recognition. Um, so... And then uh, I also wanted to show you, actually, sorry, before we go any further here, the, um, oh, I lost my bearings. The first hidden wall is actually back here. Um, I think my perception might have, yeah. So I'm going to have to take some more Mentats uh, and read. Uh, but we already have the security pass, so it doesn't matter. Uh, the first hidden wall is here, if you can't detect it. And then the second hidden wall is around on the other side here. Oh, man, so you go to the right, and then it's just this wall right here. This is where the second uh, wall is, so yeah. So And then there's a locked door, so let's pick this. what's in here nothing easy terminal I don't know if we need to hack this but we'll do it anyways uh, village oh perfect that never happens on the first try <sighs> okay so here we go encrypted message this is the part of the the first free quest access power. I've managed to get a password to Isley's computer. I'll forward it to you with the release notes to the Q35. The prototype is going to be stopping here on its way to the Department of Department of Defense. You should be able to intercept it on the road. And then if you read this, it says, um, while version 32 didn't have the power yield of the version 31 or 30, we managed to increase in the stabilization threshold by approximately 27.35%. This is promising, however, we still have yet to come up with a solution for the water inversion issues. <laughs> so these notes are kind of like crazy. This weapon was developed. Uh, so then they um, were able to solve the issue um, And you can also pause and read this. There we go. Uh, and then you can pause and read these. And you can pause and read these. So that is important information because you need that. See, it says note added matter modulator projector. Uh, that is the weapon that's in this building that's a prototype that is behind that locked door down in the foyer. Um, so we want to get that. So that's it for this room. Actually, was that a, a round? Uh, bobble gum. Uh, annoying. Hello, Mrs. Millet. I hope you have an excellent day at work today. Oh, thank you, Mr. Robot. Uh, let's hack this door. Oh, come on. Uh, there we go. And this is a storeroom. And this, this room has some pretty good loot in it. Uh, there's a first aid box. 
There is some ammunition and a doctor's bag I can see there. So we'll grab all of this. Ammunition, toolbox, duct tape, scrap electronics. And is that a stim pack? Yes. And the tool cabinet is empty. Okay, and then the last room here. This is the Repcon office main floor. The door is locked. You need a lock pick of 75 or higher, which we may have. Yeah, see, we read our magazine and we lost it now, right? So I don't think we have another lock pick magazine. Nope. We might have to come back to that after. And then there's this, which goes up to the third floor, which is uh, we have restricted access to. So we won't go up there just just yet. And then uh, there's some office spaces back here, um, which we can explore. Uh, and there's no other way out of this room other than the way we came in. So that's good. Um, and then this actually, this office has more information on that weapon. Um, I believe somewhere around here, one of these terminals or something must have that one. No. Hmm. Interesting. I thought that it might have been. Oh, this isn't the right. Uh, it's the. It's I think this office that we can't get into. Ah. We might be able to take some mentats that will increase. Um, let me see. Mentats. Nope. And we've become addicted. Excellent. Always a good thing. So let's just go back. How may I serve you, Master? Oh God. Let's just go back this way. And. Hello, Mrs. Millet. God, these guys are annoying. There, okay, so there's the second floor security card, which we need. Oh, that first aid box had a lot of good stuff in it. And then this terminal is, uh, you need a science skill of 75 or higher. So let's read a science magazine, which we have four of, very convenient. Consisting, there we go. Excellent. Okay, print executive security badge. So this is the terminal that you want to access because, um, you want to be able to print this badge. Printing this badge will um, allow you access to any door leading to the top floor or the back to the main floor. So that's important. So you want to obtain that. And then you can pause and read this too. So that's good to, uh, if you have to waste your resources to hack that terminal, then you read your last magazine because that's the terminal oh, that you, you are going to need to read in order to access the top floor. So here's another storeroom. Whoops, that's empty. Uh, and is that a weapon back there? Oh, it's a hammer. Turpentine. Stim pack. Always good. Metal box. Nuka Cola. Metal box. Pack of cigarettes. Actually, I have a lot of Nuka Colas that I need to drink, so I should probably do that. And purified water and sunset sarsaparilla. Okay. Uh, okay. So this is the room that we were previously in. 
where we added the facial recognition data. And this is the last room that we need to go into. Do, 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 some rounds. Uh, okay. Bottle cap. Sunset sarsaparilla. Empty. And this room. Do, do, do. That's empty. That's empty. That's empty. Filing cabinets, three bottle caps, and the ashtray, which I took. <laughs> How annoying. And then we're back out in the main corridor that we were previously in. So we've kind of explored all of this area, um, except for uh, the door that's locked here, which we may have access to now that we have that security print ba printed security badge. Yes. And this actually heads back down to... The main office because once you enter into the second floor you actually lose the access that you have but now we're okay and we can use the key to access this door which contains dun, da, 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 the q35 uh, modulator whoops which is where is it there it is Do, do, do. Q35 Matter Modulator. Sounds like something out of like Marvin the Martian. Q35 Matter Modulator. I'm going to ruin you. Uh, okay, so then there's the third Nikola Tesla and You skill book that is available in the Repcon headquarters. And a bunch of microfusion cells. Excellent. And let's open the safe. 12 gauge round, 75 bottle caps. Excellent. Sawed off shotgun. We are way over encumbered. <laughs> and all of that crap. And there's a bunch of scrap metal, which I'm not going to take, but I think that that's. Yeah. Uh, and then, so let's go into our inventory and just uh, do some stuff here. Laser pistol. Uh, plasma rifle. So you can actually use the existing plasma rider rifle to fix the Q35 matter modulator. Sawed off shotgun. You don't want those throwing spears. And yeah, Just don't want that. Uh, Tales of a Chivalrer. I don't want that. Um, mac and cheese, bubble gum, crispy squirrel bits. Okay. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. And I'll show you the, the Q Matter 35, Q35 Matter Modulator. I don't actually want to fire my weapon because it'll it may ruin that quest that I'm working on. So actually what we're going to do is we'll end the video here and uh, if you like this click the like button, share it with your friends, make sure that you can, uh, you can navigate to my website and check out the rest of these videos and what we'll do is we'll pick up in the next video and we'll go to the third floor. So I hope you like this video and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching.